I'm just doing a current draw check on a little 696 Monster that has battery going flat or appearing to not hold charge, parked, come back, won't start. So the current draw is a good way to work out if anything's happening when the ignition's turned off. There's three cables on this. This one is to the SATA solenoid. This one is just into the general wiring loom and powers the ABS unit as well. And this is his battery tender which shouldn't have anything in it, but you need to check everything. So we've got the multimeter. It's on the, the milliamps setting. Um, what you're looking for is milliamps. On one of these, a constant six milliamp draw will kill the battery. Uh, these bikes have an immobilizer, so the immobilizer light when it flashes will spike the, the milliamp reading, but you just sort of don't worry about that too much because it's not a consistent draw. What we'll do, is we'll plug into the starter motor wire first and we'll see if we get anything and it's zero and that's good because it is just the starter solenoid power wire there shouldn't be any current draw there we'll try his little battery tender once again no current draw there as expected or as hoped and this is the main power wire. So now we should see a draw here because it'll be the dashboard will draw power. The ECU might draw a little bit of power. So we'll just hook it up and see what we get. Okay, so it's hooked up. And we've got 60 milliamps spiking to 70 when the little light flashes on the dash. But that's not actually a problem because what we'll see is after a certain period of time, that will drop. And so if you're doing a current draw, you just need to wait and wait maybe a minute or so. And I think it's due to the dashboard running all its procedures as it powers itself up because once it's powered up, it will drop down to less than one milliamp. But we just need to wait. You can play some thinking music in your head. I guess I could have timed how long it was taking. I would expect it to, if you don't run this test for at least a minute, I would expect your answer to possibly be um, unrealistic because they, they can take quite some time. There we go, it's dropped. So we got half a milliamp and then spiking with the light on the dash. And the light on the dash is that light. So it just flashes. And that's enough to spike the reading quite a bit. So that's current draw. In this case, there isn't anything significant, so that part of it's fine.